trends like you know home working or being able to do a lot of uh, collaboration, um, being able to uh, and basically reduce travel, leveraging cloud. These are here to stay. You know, through the pandemic, we've learned a lot. We've learned how businesses can adapt, and uh, and therefore this is really putting pressure on companies and organizations that haven't. Uh, taken the step towards digital transformation. But on the other side, you also see some very good examples of companies that have invested and are able to adapt uh, very well. You know, I mean, as an example, our customer DHL, who's adapting very well to be able to deal with the, the needs for distributing vaccines, et cetera, and, and, uh, and you know, doing the logistics. Uh, Maccabi Healthcare is another customer in Israel um, who has been able to do the distribution or, and, and the administration of the vaccines. So uh, there are very good examples where investment in technology uh, is paying off, uh, but it's also a bit of a wake-up call for companies that have not really uh, taken that step. Sanjay, um, talking to uh, COOs um, and those responsible for signing contracts. I've, I've heard a lot of people talk about a rabbit in the headlights moment around the pandemic. And you get the sense that a, a lot of chief operating officers are, are, are being, should we say, parsimonious with the checkbook at the moment because they're just not quite sure what the outlook for full year 2021 will be. You've said here in your statement that the pipeline on new subscription sign up looks good for 2021 but are you starting to wonder if the if, if the pace of that sign up may be a little delayed here while we still have issues with the pandemic and the lockdowns well what i would say is you know i think ceos cfos cios they're getting very clear about or are starting to be very specific about what is mission critical for them and what's nice to have. So this, they are putting their decisions into these two buckets. And so software and technology, which is mission critical, gets the priority and gets the funding. And that's that's the experience that we have seen and that, de that gets demonstrated in the results that we are achieving. The other thing I would say is, I have not experienced um, CEOs talking about slowing down their investment in technology. In fact, because of the needs of having their people work from home or the necessity to break down these uh, data in silos, allowing the data to be able to be accessible, you know, with our integration and IoT platform technologies, we see the investment coming through and customers considering that as mission critical.